I'm an addict for sneakers, 20s of Buddha and bitches with beepers in the streets I could reach her about Yo, what's good YouTube? It's your boy Nate Triple OG, often imitated, never duplicated, with the best on feats in the game! Yo, what's good? I told you guys I had a video coming up for you guys. I had the Sakai Waffle that I should have did the video for a while ago, but you, again, your boy was kind of lazy, but I told you guys in my last video, the giveaway video, make sure you guys hit that subscribe button, ring that bell, hit that notification bell so you guys can stay in tune with what's going on. Make sure you also Go to my Instagram, like the page or whatever, and follow so you guys can stay up to date on this giveaway. I am doing a Travis Scott giveaway. One of those videos should be on my Instagram. Um, I do have the Travis Scott, so I did that whole thing. I'll put a link right here, like the card. Click the card, go to the page, and you know, or whatever, go to the video, and you guys can see, get all that information for that. Anyway, yo, got something special for you guys. Boom, you already know what time it is. It's orange boxes. Orange says and I in on that side. Ike on that side. Got them Nike joints, them Sakai's. Can you guess what colorway I have? No, I don't. Can you guess which colorway it is? I didn't say what colorway it is inside the video. I might as well say what colorway it is now. There's no reason to guessing because you guys already know. Now I'm rambling. I'm bugging. Anyway, let's go ahead, get up close and personal with this shoe. Boom, you already know what time it is. I got that Nike Sakai size nine. I don't know, I got the box the right side. Up, oh, boy, yeah, that is the right side. Anyway, size nine, 10 and a half in women's. The colorway I got is the Barney colorway. I can't read that. Let's get up close and personal with the shoe. I'm gonna show you guys the shoe. I don't really know if I'm gonna do it on feet because the question is, should the shoe stay? or should it go let me know should i keep this joint or should i let it go i'm really tempted on letting it go um my my best friend his girlfriend called them the bumper shoes i'm trying to trade them to her trying to trade them to her so she can give me those off-white blazes but she ain't really feeling that move so obviously that's not gonna happen so that can't happen hopefully i can sell these or maybe trade them in ds this pair for a ds pair of the Grim Reaper Blazers? Is that a fair trade? Do you think somebody would make that trade with me? You know, I don't want to stock X them. I'm really like not feeling that. And that, oh, that's a discussion video that we will have. I was actually talking to another YouTuber. Her name is Cuter Queen. Uh, I'll probably tag her in that video that I do, that I will do talking about like the whole stock X situation. This is the second time, man. Second time they've been infiltrated, man. Second time motherfuckers came through with the army green, straight infiltrated them and about to. Anyway, let's get up close and personal with this shoe right about now. Yo, all right, so let's get into it. Yo, I got the camera like staged up so I can show you guys everything and hopefully I can see everything. So we got that size nine, like I said. You got this Nike right here on a shoe box or whatever. It's like glossy. Got that glossy Nike everywhere. One says says IKE. The other side of the box got that in. You got all that information right there or whatever. Let's go ahead and get up close with the shoes. Boom. First thing we're gonna do once we open that joint. Jeez, I hope this turns out right. Ah! This ain't working. Change the plan. So I tried to do it another way as far as like having it prompt up, but this is gonna be like a whole motion type of thing. So boom. When I open it up, you got that paper. Obviously it says the ties. The shoes come wrapped up like so. Let's go ahead and take that joint out right there. Let's take that joint. They both wrapped up. I'm gonna show you both of them. As you can see, like I said, that paperwork says Sakai all in the inside. Man, I am so grateful. One of my homegirls that work at Nike, I told her like, yo, pray for me, man. I really want a pair. I don't know if she prayed for me, but your boy got a pair. And let's go ahead and get into that right about now. Boom, there you go. We got that Barney colorway of the Sakai's, yo. I like this colorway. Now, if you look at the shoe strings, some people thought that it didn't come with extra shoe strings, but it actually does. There it is. It's a pair of black shoe strings or whatever, and you can go ahead and do that whole thing, have that correct contrast thing. I was wondering, why wouldn't they give you like purple or maybe like green to really like sauce it up? Why would they give you black? I don't know. Anyway, so we're going to look at it. You got the double checks over there. One green, one like a banana yellow. Not so yellow. Got that green mesh right there. Both bumpers of the toe. The toe box right there. Got that. It's, this feels more like a green uh, new buck. 
and this one here is like a suede now it's not the highest quality of suede but it is what it is obviously on the bottom of the shoe you guys know you got that waffle pattern right there um let's look at that what does that say right there hold on hold on hold on let's see if we can focus that in for you guys right there so just in case you get you a pair and you're trying to find out yo what's really good that shit is on the bottom and that's on the size nine jeez my battery is about to hold <laughs> My battery about to, I can't believe my fucking battery is about to die. Hold up, y'all. Five minutes later. All right, sorry about that, guys. I'm going to go ahead and leave the shoe stationary. We're not going to be moving around. Anyway, you got that green again. You got that orange here. That's like an orange Nike sound, like that original Nike orange. You got the green mess here. Like I told you guys, this feels more like, well, on this, on the back half, oh they switched it up so on the back half here this feels like suede and obviously this is like a leather here it's not the greatest quality of leather and on the front on the toe box here this has the suede here and this has like supposedly leather or more like like um uh what is it uh new buck i don't know anyway you got two laces there i know they both look white by the camera but one is like a off white kind of like a cream and then the other one here is white like i said they did give you another pair of laces which are black i don't know if i will be trying to like do all that work to i don't know double up these laces here look at your tongue right there hold on let me see if i can focus it up for you guys bong you got the double nike check double tongue situation nike sky on the back nike sportswear in the front man this is a pretty dope shoe man nice white sole all the way around got that bumper there nike sakai on the back right there um yeah on both shoes actually nothing major nothing major if you've seen one sakai you've seen them all again i am so happy to have these in the collection but i don't know if they're gonna stay man i just don't know man what do you guys think let me know in that comment section would you keep these or would you try to trade them for a grill you know what i'm saying is this shoe worth keeping you know i'm pretty much like a masculine man do you think that this purple and green is for girls is the barney colorway for girls i know in today's age we try to keep everything unisex yeah no you know what i'm saying oh let me show you guys show you guys the insole so your shoe is stuffed in with all this paper and junk but in that insole you do got that sticker right there well with the size on there let me focus that up for you guys oh i know you guys are like damn that shit don't auto focus got the nine there got the kind of inside you know pretty dope shoe man um i was able to win these uh via raffle uh through no tray thank god they had a situation when you donated shoes you donated a pair of your old shoes that they took to the the nike uh recreation space the one created by virgil abloh and once you do that they uh take those old shoes that you donated and they turned them into like gravel or whatever. And they're going to use that in the future for a basketball court in the city of Chicago. I think they're going to do that around all-star time. You know, it's going to be lit in the city around all-star time. So I can't wait for that. Can't wait for that court. They recently just made a court, I believe, on 47th Street in Chicago by the artist Hebrew Brantley. Um, I've been really into his work lately. I want to go ahead and cop me a couple pieces. Show you guys some of that stuff maybe in another video because I'm really getting into the arts. Yeah. But anyway... Are you guys feeling this shoe? Are you feeling that bumper? I remember seeing a video when somebody cut the bumper off. You know what I mean? That waffle situation at the bottom. Look at that. Not bad, man. Not bad at all. Get that string out of there. Anyway, let's get back face to face and go over the shoe. All right, so are you guys feeling that? Are you guys feeling the Sakai? Is this shoe worth keeping? Do you like them? Uh, my complete honest opinion about the shoe you know i really wanted this i really wanted this shoe um more or less i wanted the og colorway um i do i am very appreciative that i was able to come up on this pair um i might keep the shoe man i might keep it the whole thing that i fear about the shoe and which i don't know because like i said i didn't get the og colorway is this whole mesh situation like so you got the mesh and like what type of socks like obviously you, you're gonna see your socks in this shoe because this mesh you're just gonna see it uh one of the things i do worry about is the durability of the shoe because of the mesh you know what i mean i'm really light on my shoes anyway but i'm really curious like is it gonna hold up will this shoe stand the test of time you know we love these uh collabs and everything with these other um 
with these other companies and everything, all these artists and everything to get down with Nike. We love the collaborations, but you know, the best collab that I've ever seen and which is my favorite and actually these are the shoes that I am wearing. I'm guys gonna show I'm gonna show you guys those is the Just Don Beach. That's the best collab that I've in my personal in my personal opinion with um Nike Jordan brand. Just Don the Just Don uh Jordan 2 is the best, best quality, best everything. That's just in uh, my my personal opinion. Um, yeah, that's the that's the best collab. But we are messing. I am fucking with this, and you know, it's dope. But again, I just wonder: um, will it stand the test of time? You know, will it? Will I be able to keep this shoe for a while? I know I was talking to somebody else, another sneakerhead. They were saying that this shoe is like should be sneaker of the year. Now the that. that that's pretty that's that's some big talk um i'm not i'm not ready to say all of that i'm not ready to say that sneaky of the year but i will say this is like one of the best collabs this year because you got a thing when we start talking that sneaker of the year talk we gotta start we gotta bring in those fair gods you know what i'm saying we definitely gotta bring in the travis scott ones those came out this year i know it was in the beginning of the year but it did come out this year so you got those travis scott's you got these guys you got you know, um, the fear of gods, uh, you got the whole LA to LA to Chicago, those, that situation, I know that's just a Jordan shoe, it's not like a collab, but you got the LA to Chicago's, and fuck, you got the MCAs, the, um, the off-white MCAs that came out this year, so, you know how to, you know how to, you know how the game go, people be hyped up and everything, you know what I mean, about like the shoes, it doesn't even matter, it's, it's all hype, you know what I mean, but anyway, let me know what you guys think, Hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, ring that bell, tell me how you feeling these, feeling these. Make sure you go to that last video, man. Hit that like button, subscribe to this channel because I am doing a giveaway of the Travis Scott Jordan 1s. The highs, not the lows. I, I, I don't fuck with them lows, though. I ain't gonna even stun on y'all. I don't fuck with them lows. Anyway, that's what we doing. The shoes that I'm wearing today are these. Hold on. Let me take these off. Hold on. That is the Just Done Beach. Again, this is the best Jordan collab to me. You know what I mean? Just the, the quality. Oh my God. These joints still look like new. I was able to get actually that size nine for a still of a deal. Yo, I love this shoe. I'm not going to even stunt. This is my joint right here. This, when it comes to quality, this is my joint. This is my joint. Anyway, like I said, like the video, subscribe, all that shit. How many times can I say subscribe in a video? Goddamn. Anyway, I'm going to leave you guys with some positive feedback again, 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 again. In life, we go through things. We go through ups and downs. You know what I'm saying? Things can get rough. You probably can lose motivation. And, you know, you probably want to stop doing whatever it is you whatever it is you had your mind set on, right? You was, you probably picked up steam and then you start you know losing that steam remember life is not a sprint it actually is a marathon shout out to nip but even though you know you're going through those trials and tribulations you gotta roll with the punches roll with the punches you get knocked down get back up keep going keep striving keep succeeding keep doing you thank you guys for watching the video thank you for whomever that leaves that thumbs up thank you to the guys that leave me that critical feedback i love it how at you guys next time peace to fuck it i'm out man i'm just happy to start doing my videos again Holla.